Jesus loves me, this I know For the Bible tells me so Little ones to Him belong They are weak, but He is strong Yes, Jesus loves me Yes, Jesus loves me Yes, Jesus loves me The Bible tells me so Jesus loves me he who died heaven's gates to open wide he will wash away my sin let his little child come in yes Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me, the Bible tells me so. loves me yes Jesus loves me yes Jesus loves me the Bible tells me so can you say I love you say it again I love you you. I love you. Good job. Now let's say, Jesus loves me. Can you say that? Jesus loves me. Good job. I'm so proud of you for saying that so good. Do you know what kind of musical instrument this is? It's a guitar. Can you say guitar? Guitar. A guitar is one of my absolute favorite musical instruments to play. It sounds so good. A guitar has strings on it, and the strings are what make the sound. You hear that? Also, if I press my fingers at different places on the guitar's neck, it changes the sound. Listen to this. Isn't that cool, the way the note changes? I can also use more than one of my fingers to play what's called a chord, and it sounds like this. Ooh, that's a nice sounding chord. Let's try another one. So pretty. Another thing that I can do with the guitar is use a pick instead of my fingers to strum the strings. And if I use the pick, it'll be louder. Isn't that awesome? I love the way a guitar sounds when I'm strumming with a guitar pick. Okay, let's sing a song about God and how big God is. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. The mountains are His, the rivers are His, the skies are His handiwork too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. Good job! Thanks for singing that song with me. Can you help me count how many toy cars will fit 
on this little table. Let's start. Here's the first car. It's an awesome green and black car. Looks pretty fast too. So let's put it right over here. So how many cars do we have? That's right, one car. Can you say one? Can you hold up one finger? One car. Let's get another one. Here's another one. Look at this. This thing is big. It's a big white SUV. So let's put it right here. And now we have one, two cars. Can you say two? Hold up two fingers. Awesome. We've got some more room. Let's keep going. Next, we've got this awesome red truck. That's pretty sweet. We'll put it right here. And now we have one, two, three cars. Can you hold up three fingers? That's awesome. Here's another car, and this one is gray. Let's put it right here. So how many cars do we have now? Let's count. One, two, three, and four. We've got four cars. Okay, I think there's room for one more. Here we go, the last car. It's a fancy looking one. So let's put it right over here. So how many cars do we have? Let's count them one more time. One, two, three, and four, and five. We've got five cars. That's awesome, can you say five? Good job, thank you for helping me count these cars. Do you know what kind of musical instrument this is? It might look like a guitar, but it's actually a ukulele. That's kind of a hard word to say. You wanna try? Say ukulele. It kind of looks like a small guitar, but it only has four strings instead of six like a guitar does. You play the ukulele a lot like a guitar though, using your fingers to strum the strings and to press down the notes on the neck. I think the ukulele is one of the happiest sounding musical instruments. It just makes me want to smile. What a cool instrument. Building up the temple, building up the temple, building up the temple of the Lord. Oh brother, won't you help me? Sister, won't you help me? Building up the temple of the Lord. I'm building up the temple, building up the temple, building up the temple of the Lord. Oh mommy, won't you help me? Daddy, won't you help me? Building up the temple of the Lord Building up the temple Building up the temple Building up the temple of the Lord Oh, uncle, won't you help me? Auntie, won't you help me? Building up the temple of the Lord. I'm building up the temple, building up the temple, building up the temple of the Lord. Oh, grandma, won't you help me? Grandpa, won't you help me? Building up the temple of the Lord. Can you guess what I've got in this box? You hear that? All right. It is a bunch of tiles for building stuff. Look at that. We've got all kinds of colors, some different shapes and versions of it with holes cut out of them. 
And the thing is, they stick together because of magnets. Isn't that awesome? So, I'm thinking we need to build something. Should we build maybe a tower? Yeah, let's do that. So to start, we'll take a few of these pieces and we'll stick them together like that to make a square. You see that? And we'll use that as our bottom layer to start building. So maybe we'll take this piece like that. Let's grab a few more. Okay, this is already going pretty well. I want it to be really tall, so we're just gonna keep going up and up and up. up. Oh, it broke. Man, that's too bad. But you know what? Let's try it again. I bet we can do it even better the second time. So maybe we'll start with a bottom piece to make it a little bit more sturdy. And we'll stick these pieces here. I like this. All right. And now let's try to go up again. See, we don't have to get upset when things don't work out. Sometimes it just takes another try. Oh, this is going well. So we're up to three layers high. And now let's go to the fourth layer. Oh boy, this is looking awesome. And now that we're up to this height, I think we'll add some of these big narrow triangles up at the top. And then we'll stick them together to make a pointy top like that. Oh, that's so cool. This is an awesome tower. I wonder though, what if we would make a little platform to put like a toy car on or something? I think that's a good idea to you. Let's try it. All right, so here's a piece that we can use as our platform. Oh, wait. It's not staying up. I think we need something to make it stronger so that it stays in place. I bet if we use these triangles like this, we can put the piece on top. Yes, and it's staying sturdy. Okay, let me grab a toy car and let's see if it works. Okay, I found something even better than a toy car. It's a toy plane, look at that. So this is perfect. It can come flying in and land right on this platform. Yeah, that's awesome. Look how cool this tower is with the little landing pad for the airplane. That's awesome. Thanks for helping me build this tower. It turned out so good. Did you know that music can sound happy or sad? Listen to this chord I'm gonna play. Does it sound happy or sad? What do you think? Happy or sad? I think that's a happy sounding chord. That's because it's what's called a major chord. Can you say major? Major. Major chords usually sound happy. But there's another kind of chord. How does this chord sound? Does that sound happy or sad? Yeah. I think it sounds sad. That's because that is a minor chord. Minor chords usually sound more sad. But what's cool about music is that you can use both the happy chords and the sad chords to make beautiful music. When I was playing the guitar there, I used both some sad chords and some happy chords 
because they all work together to make beautiful music. I think that's pretty cool, don't you? Hi, it's Guitar Guy Q and Felix. Felix is my son. I'm Felix's dada. Can you say dada? Dada. Dada. What are we gonna play with today, Felix? <gasps> are these dinosaurs? Can you say dino? Oh, that's what a dino says. Dino says rawr. Felix, what color is this dino? Dino. No, he's not yellow. Look, he's blue. Can you say blue? Blue, blue good job. He's pretty scary. Let's put him right over here. Wow, look at this one. Is that a T-Rex? That's a scary one. What color is he? Green. No, he's not green. He's orange. Can you say orange? Mm. Say orange. Mm. Good try. Can you say orange? Orange. He's a cool dinosaur. We'll put him over here. What about this one? What color is he? Yeah, he's yellow. He also has some orange spikes on top. Wow, that is a cool dinosaur. Yeah, this one is green. And he also has some orange on him too. Wow, that's a scary looking one. Wow. What, what color is this one? Yeah, this one is black. It's a Triceratops. Which one of these dinosaurs is your favorite, Felix? Yeah. You like this one? Yeah, that's a cool one. Should we make them jump around? Jump, jump, jump. Can we make the Triceratops jump? Good job. Yeah. Well, that was fun. Can you tell everybody bye? Say bye. 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 Can you wave? your hand.